All right, here we go. Resident Evil 3. First time I'm loading this game up, I played a demo. The demo that they released about a week ago. So here we are with the full release. Just downloaded it. Been waiting for this one. All right, I got my got my graphics options already set. That ought to do. Could set it higher, but want to make damn sure that my frame rate remains steady as hell. So let's do this. Huh. Huh. Okay. I'm gonna go with the default for the moment. Continue. Because oh, there's nothing to continue. Go standard. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Authorities are bracing for more rioting tonight. He was knocked unconscious. Citywide emergency is declared. The CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern region of the U.S. Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the core values that create the foundation for Umbrella. It's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. I can control this. This game wasn't a fucking first person game. I mean, 7 was first person. I actually got books. So. Lusitania. I have that book. No, literally, I have that exact book. It's got that cover, that spine, and everything. You know, I never understand the concept of the yarn stuck between tacks. Because, like, what is the point of that? Are you trying to, like, say, this is related to this? Because if you need yarn for that, then you've got problems. Should get that looked at.
gets worse every night. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. Hey, why don't why don't you do it now? What is your uh, lease not up until the end of the month? Look at the size of that remote. You know it's the nineties, but shit. Normally, I wouldn't read these kinds of things, but since this is the first time I'm playing it, I might, so this is going to take longer than usual. Of course, she's a cop. She loves donuts. Peter Pan on that motherfucker. Why is your light switch inside the room like that? Oh, jeez. You left your sink running. Oh, all right. <laughs> so now we got the third person view. Who could that be? Raccoon milk. Oh god. Oh, yeah, close that door. <laughs> all right, I'm coming. Oh, Brad's still alive. Oh, they sent her that pizza. Hello? Jill, are, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... Ah! <laughs> Nemesis right in the beginning. Oh. Yeah, that'll do it. What's the police tape about? Up. Oh. Shit's gone south. How are you still alive? And what exploded? Is there a meth lab in this building?
stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. How this all happen so fast? I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like our play on steroids. Top gun knockoff. Yeah, leave her behind. Thanks. First run in the bread in a restaurant, but they, I don't know, he's being portrayed a little bit more of a, less of a loser in this game. <laughs> Sorry. A little bit less. Up, oh, I guess they got through. the bail. What the fuck? <laughs> parking garage roof. Running through some of the beats of the original game, like that guy hid in the back of the truck. Sir, what's your name? I can't just leave you behind. It's Dario Rosso. And yeah, right. You just want to steal my safe house. Get your own, Missy. Missy? He hid in the back of the truck and he eventually died. Though I guess it's not really a truck, it's a sort of just a cargo container. But, uh, they're slamming through their beats pretty quick. But the... The, um... I don't know that. Lip-syncing. See, this game definitely feels a little bit like it's, um... More of a... Developed on a budget than 2 was. Oh, uh, yeah, this seems like a great idea. get infected. Look how bad the animations are, how choppy they are at a distance. That is like less than half rate frame rate. I mean, I got a relatively beefy PC here. There should be an option of letting them run at full frame rate. It just looks terrible. I get that something similar was done in Resident Evil 2 Remake, but they... Um, there weren't as many chances for you to see enemies at a great distance 
I'm seeing them all the damn time here. I wonder if there's going to be a mod that fixes that. Damn it, what? <laughs> really? Get in. You haven't landed. Ah, uh, something. Ah, uh, yep. Just keep getting thrown up against things. F to pay respects. It's my turn, bitch. Okay, she definitely should be dead by this point. I'm saving you. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. I think we're in the clear. Hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Remember, you gotta maintain oh, six feet. On. Who's the dipshit to close this? Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. BBCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Look, you don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on, it's this way. Captain, this fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? 
She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, Platoon Leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. All right, so this is where the demo started. So just gotta... Why isn't he coming with her? Um... Da, 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 da. How did shit go bad this fast? Me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You mind getting the subway infrastructure back online? And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Why, if this is their weapon cache, why is it not down in the subway cars? Because that seems to be where I would put it. <laughs> Wouldn't, uh, wouldn't be leaving it upstairs. And if it's supposed to be all these weapons and... Oh, okay. You need to find a key somewhere. Why are they keeping it all the way up here? Alright, so I'm, I'm gonna... Store most of this shit. And I'm gonna save... Then I'm going to shut the game down and check the audio levels. Because I've, uh, I don't know how this sounds. And plus, it's honestly a little bit too quiet for me. I want it to be louder. So, 